wasn't. Well, there's the, the, the only, you know, it, it seems serious, but it, but it shouldn't be. The, they just did the vignette or the backstage interview. You couldn't uh, continue yep. to do that, and not the match shouldn't didn't have to happen. Uh -oh. Then also, uh, whenever somebody gets wow, well, dude, Austin's you like, just did not example, plan that out well at all. He dropped on his head by Owen. Sorry, it was dude. promos. It was there, and the storyline was that he needed to still come to work to make money because he parked right he behind had somebody. To feed. They say it's a workflow application that Raw developed, so maybe it's ah, a finally get a streamer. A mighty seven incidents of disrespect in one semester. This is the tip of the iceberg when you consider what goes on under the radar of the school staff. They can't be expected to be everywhere, and it all influences our children. Oh, wow, did that thing just click off? parking spots people are still going to park there anyway and they say that's what it's worth that's fairly clean uh -oh. when it comes to this sort of stuff it gets really sloppy uh, my neighbor is too loud always on headlights crack again legal so if if chris has two months left on his contract the wwe can talk to chris but it's not about the two months that's left in his contract. Show studio, the address. Not so good, scary movie. Black 
as I go yeah. down this hill. I checked them before going down. General, really good rule of thumb. If they ain't failing good on Lad Canyon, pull over on Cabbage and adjust them. Damn, I always get the really good clouds when it goes around a corner. Damn, it's like low level fog. Brakes aren't working too good. It can't be. It, it, nothing will be. You won't feel anything wrong. But when you start getting right around 222, 221, yeah, that can be the result. Okay. Smells like metal getting welded. so I can get the video. Did it belong to being feet there? Ah. One of 
my great big pet peeves. I want to take the next exit, but I got this guy doing about 45. Don't want to pass him because I don't want to miss the exit. <laughs> finally, that other guy been behind me this entire time. Finally, start. Finally passed. Oh no, we have to track. Oh, of course. That's right, let's walk in front of all the trucks that need to move. Let's not walk behind them. You want to save some time? The next time you rent a DVD? Well, we don't know. I'm Sir David Attenborough, and this is Unknown History. Well, what are these lights about to turn? Geneva, Switzerland, 1816. Friends gather and then you hear this bang far off and then black guys move around. You gotta see it. They fall dead. I love the titles like that too. Yeah. Bring me the head of Fredo Garcia. Yeah, because they want to make it a difficult. So it's got the closed gear, although I wish I could move it. This particular TV has the closed captioning on the top of the screen. Uh, so well, thanks for giving me a good show at least. You. <laughs> <laughs> I, and I especially like it because I'm watching this. Um, lastly, Billy Joe Armstrong drops out of high school to pursue music in 1990. That did the piano man. Yeah. No, no, that's Billy Joe. I wanted to move over for the guy on the right side, but uh, he would not let me. Uh, Merging traffic must yield, and you yeah. will yield to me. I'm more important. Think about this, too. Something else that you already pointed out earlier in the show. This is during the time period where blood bands were in place. Oh God, yeah. Okay, but so there's that. How do you have war games when nobody's waiting? Right. When my day, everyone I was in, we were all bleeding. Here's another issue. Yeah. You got Vader and Sid. They're that guy's speed falling through town, forced me to put my brakes on for these two who wouldn't speed up. There's not a lot of person now. Well, one cage or two cages. You guys cannot get out. There's a roof on it. Now you look at your ash cage. Said, hey, we're going to close the discussion this week uh, on Paul Wall. Story with a guy that absolutely perfectly fit the world. He would so good, I think. Yeah. Well, they would have been a whole different story. Yeah, if, if well, if they would have turned around. Yep, that's right. Speed on by. And then you gotta hit your brakes. All right, I can kinda pretty much guess what happened here. He got pulled in for overweight on some of his axle groups. And it turns out the cars were not positioned right, so now he's repositioning cars. Hmm. I think those axles are about far enough apart to allow 20 a piece on them. Uh -oh. town, and I couldn't wait for that to get off the ground. You and you couldn't have filled it up? Three feet back? Oh my god. It's got a whole bunch of blood. Get out those guitars, man. It'll be the Funny Bone in St. Charles, Missouri, Friday, October 27th and the 28th. That's a Saturday. Then November 4th, the Ho-Chunk Casino, Wisconsin Dells. That one is with Mr. Jeff Hoskey and Willie G. Willie's in Chicago. We expect a phone call from Willie today or tomorrow to see what's going on up there. He's also part of our special show coming to Wisconsin. I'll give you some details on that. People have to slow way down for this way station. No, you don't. I get slowing down the curves and the hill but please you don't have to drop this dang low for the way station oh yeah he's uh really flooring it right now One of them, I think, is a jockstrap. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Three. 
I mean, back in the day, they didn't have websites. Free for yeah. one pickup truck. Maybe no. This guy, maybe this guy well, was they did, but you could make that yeah, four. Maybe this guy was a sex oh, I suggest that we return to the uh, news desk with the first day. What you got over there? National Toy Hall of Fame is celebrating its 25th anniversary this year, and they're going to ask for more of the public's participation. Racehorse, one's a wild little hand, good little hand. Wonky little fella from China. Yeah, okay, so, bro. Oh, now, man. Drew is going for the heavyweight Let's battle. see bro, if I can get him to go by me. 50 50 with Sami Zayn. And then there uh, has to be outside you interference just me already. as an excuse for there we go. to go after <laughs> Sammy Zane. So I'm watching this and I'm... You were going to kill Randy. Would that be right? Yeah. Oh, come on. Really? What? Really? To kill Randy oh, I don't have to answer that. No. No, you don't. You Why don't not go you to know. the light over there? Instead of risking getting yourself mind. hit. Problem. And this is why it goes back to the WWE. The fact that they're invited to these press conferences, they, they think, they think, bro, that 